If you're a fan of history of the telecommunications industry, you may recall that for many years, most phone calls placed went through one central building in downtown Boston. Today, you'd have a much harder time telling me when and where your call gets processed. I think this is an interesting parallel to draw to the banking space, because if you think back to when Alexander Hamilton started Bank of New York, to where we are today, the change in the banking ecosystem is fairly magnificent. Now, I use the word ecosystem because I've spent the last few weeks in the fintech ecosystem, and I think it's important to understand who's playing in that space right now. It's easy to think of the market as two-sided, that is, bank executives and technology firms that are either looking to work with or against banks. But doing so ignores the fact that you have VCs, private equity money, you have institutional investors, you have shareholder expectations, you also have regulatory bodies like the OCC and the Fed, and also the government taking a real strong interest in what's happening in the fintech space. Within that ecosystem, there are various trends that are starting to take shape, and there are three that I've identified that I think are worth pursuing. The first really goes to consumer health and how it is that banks can better encourage the participation of the underserved. And I think on a global scale, this is going to be huge. I also look at the massive investment of intellectual capital that's being placed towards blockchain technology. And while the promise of blockchain is probably a few years away, I wouldn't sleep on all the work that's being done around digital identity, cryptocurrency, and the like. Finally, when we talk about fintech, it appears to be a B2C type play right now, but I could see a business to business application very soon. And if you want to tie in with a pretty poorly named Internet of Things, I could see the industrialization of fintech becoming front and center in the next few years. So to understand not just these, but other emerging issues in this fintech ecosystem, I encourage you to come and check out what we're sharing on finextech.com.